humble. We teach you to not feel yourself too much. Don't go too far in your self-belief because it might get you in trouble. It might cause you to you know, not exercise enough caution. But you know the real thing people tell you to be humble is not because they think you're going to get yourself in trouble. I mean, how many times have you gotten in trouble for not being humble? You can't, probably can't even think of it tell you that because they don't want you to go further than them they're trying to keep you next to where they at tell me tell me a time when you were so confident that it actually got you in trouble and something bad happened to you because you believed in yourself too much now tell me a time you didn't believe in yourself and enough that you ain't do what you were supposed to do and i tell people being humble is not really what you need because you already didn't try that it's always a few wise motherfuckers gonna come in and they want to start preaching about why you need to be humble. They don't even know what the opposite feels like. That's the only thing they know is to be humble. They ain't never even tried going the opposite direction. 99 people out of 100 have never gone the opposite direction, yet they want to preach why it'd be so bad to go in the opposite direction. Never even been there. It's like a motherfucker saying they don't like pizza. Ain't never had no fucking pizza. <laughs> why would you listen to them? I'm in the room and I'm like, basketball is the best sport. And somebody else says, no, 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 basketball is not the best sport. Soccer is the best sport. And I say, all right. You know, what's your experience with basketball? And they're like, well, I ain't never played basketball. But I know soccer's the best sport. All right, you be laughing. You wouldn't even listen to me. It's, most of the time, people don't do what they want to do in life. It's not because they lack skill or determination. There's a few people with those problems. But for the most part, people are just afraid of what's going to happen if they step too far. That's all. About it. The more I realize that's really the biggest problem. Whether you, know, you got a game or don't have a game or you work hard or don't be skilled or not experienced or not. The biggest problem is people are free of what's going to happen if they go past the level they used to go. Right, this is ha it's happening because we've been socialized to blend in with everybody else. Socialized and not do anything to stand out. And we see what happens to people who do stand out, who do go too far. They get ostracized, ridiculed, attacked, and most of the time they ain't strong enough to handle it. to be humble your whole life when it's clear that humble doesn't work. And then you think, what are my other options? To not be humble? I know what's going to happen if I do that. So now you're stuck in the middle. You spend your whole life in the middle, the bottom of the pyramid with the masses. That, that I was talking about, I got a lot more coming on that. Stay tuned. But between now and then, listen, this is your primer right here. It's the mirror motivation. You see, this is my name on the book. I'm giving you this book free. It's already paid for. You just tell me where to ship it. You swipe up, take care of the shipping. The book is yours.